Hey there, kitties. Welcome back to my... Ah, uh, keep on doing that. I really need to learn. Anyway, welcome to my new short let's play of Rayman X. I said it before I even came up because the moon was inactive. Anyway... Yes, I decided to do the old SNES versions of Mega Man X. I don't feel like downloading the PS1 emulator to do that, so I'm gonna do this. Actually, it wasn't on PS1. The only one that was on PS1 was Mega Man X3. Hmm. I'm not going to read all this because it will take far too long and I don't feel like pausing I mean, clicking outside the windows to constantly stop it. That was an accident. X is the first generation of robots which contain an innovate an innovate innovative new <laughs> feature. The ability to think and make their own decisions. However, this ability could be the very could be very dangerous. If X were to break the first rule of robotics, robots will never fall in the human being. The results can be disastrous, and I feel that no force will can stop them. Approximately 30 years will be required before we can safely confirm his reliability. Unfortunately, I'm not able to see that day, nor do I have anyone to carry on my work. Therefore, I decided to seal him in this capsule, which will test his internal systems until his reliability due has been confirmed. Please do not disturb this capsule until that time. X possesses great risk, as well as great possibilities. I can only hope for the best. September 18, 20XX, Thomas White. This is the first game in a great series that Capcom stopped for some apparent reason. I, I know why they stopped, but... Yeah, but the head designer of Mega Man and creator of Mega Man left Capcom, and that's why. Yeah, this, this is... Each Mega Man X game has an intro stage, so... Yeah. This is much easier than the than the, um, the DS versions. I um, DS games. I'm not going to lie because I suck at them. Oh god! I'm trying not to. I'm trying to go for a no hit thing right here. Sorry. Actually, I can't get it. I, I just don't want to. Hi. People. By the way, it is possible that you can get crushed under that and die. So yeah. I make button matching into a sport. <laughs> it's like a machine gun. And I'm doing this on keyboard too. That means I had to take off my headphones. I just ignored that one. I just said, what's up? Bye. One of these things is going to hit me. They are going to try to hit that guy if we like. Oh, God, God, darn it. I was, I was panicking for some reason. As to why, I don't remember. <laughs> I said, Oh, he's going from both sides! No. No, no. I don't know why I said that there. <laughs> oh, 
I like how a robot on a technically a reptiloid on feet is faster than a flying ship in the air. I mean seriously, I was going faster. Also, um this is the first fight in only quite a few that you cannot win. They re they made sure you can win it, um I guess in the PSP remake of this game, which is um, Mega Man X Maverick Hunter. Maverick Hunter, Mega Man X, whatever you want to call it, or whatever. When you can actually defeat him, but it, it all ends the same way. X in this scene right here. And also, I think that scene is voiced on the PSP version. I think not only they did did they make it more look better, but I think they redesigned the stages slightly. Also, meet another character, Zero. He is pretty much more powerful than X right now. I don't I don't care what the fans say, they're both equal on strength. But X can get more powerful. And so can Zero. And if I ever get the um, the software and the hard way to do it, I will let's play all the Mega Man X games, including the horrible, horrible Mega Man X Six. Oh. And I might do X Seven as well. Might as well. I don't mind playing it, but it's just the three D aspects of it can draw people off quite a lot. I don't mind it. It's just like playing uh, Castlevania to me, pretty much. I will not be using the balls as weaknesses unless it is completely necessary, which most of the time it's not. But on the boss refights that you are in or in the Mega Man X game or the Mega Man game in general, I will use the weakness. So I am going here because it, it kind of is recommended to go here first. Because this boss is hands down the easiest to take down with the X-Buster. Okay, screw the note him dying. What? You laugh at me, you die. You deserve to die, you jerk. I just scratched my head there. Sorry. Okay, I forgot what these things are called. I'm going to call them baddies. Clever name, I know. Also, uh. Like Mega Man X5 or 6 or 7 can easily get you a carpal tunnel. That means intense cramping in your hands. Oops, sorry. I was just holding down the charge button. Hey. Anyway, X. I give you the ability to choose your own life and path. Passing life. Okay. And I hope that the world will allow you to choose a peaceful one. But now, it seems you are destined to fight. Because I thought the world might need a new champion. 
I have hidden capsules like this one. This one is not hidden at all. You find and use them, you will be able to increase your powers. Beyond anything the world has ever known. Step into this capsule and receive an acceleration system to boost your speed. Go up, X. He was going to fire. I was going to fire it anyway, so I don't know. whatever. This is when they introduced it. Introduced dashing. This replacing is replacing sliding from Mega Man X and from the Mega Man games. But you can't go under narrow paths because they have completely taken that out. Jerk. Also, they introduced bright armors into this game. Uh, there's no point in me going up because I don't have the special weapon needed. I was about to slide off. Yay, energy! Energy, yay! <coughs> yay, it's Chill Penguin. I think in the PSP version, they actually talked to X before they attempted to kill him. I don't know uh, what? I, I can't do anything here. He doesn't hit hard, but if you touch him, he hits hard. Actually, if you touch him, he deals a lot of damage, basically. I haven't really needed to do anything. <laughs> I was frozen on purpose. I was like, take this! I fired you before you die. I get frozen. Whatever. Take your pick. <laughs> Yay! Like Mega Man, you also get their special weapons. Or special ability. His special ability was Shotgun Ice, which he, I guess he used? I guess? I don't know. Also, when you defeat bosses in this game, their defeat leads to changes in different stages. Like, since I defeated him, his stage is severely easier now. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, let's see here. I'm trying to decide which boss I take on next. Hmm. Where is the head piece? Oh yeah, this one. I was about to really jump into him like, Here I go! Here I am! Hit me! No! You jerk. Hope you die of cancer. Uh, I am sorry for whoever has cancer and is watching my videos. 
I am just a jerk right now. Aren't I? <sighs> also, I'm gonna try to save state as least often as possible. If I die, I die. That's it. Also, look at this. Airport. One thousand and one. One zero zero one. One zero zero one. One zero zero one. Uh. Airport. Also, this replaces the. Well. This replaces the E tank. If that is a sub tank. I don't know why I'm saying all this, just for people who doesn't know what my name X is. Just in case you know. You never know who hasn't played what or not. So you have to explain everything. The curse of a left player. That and they usually have to play. <sighs> I should be more cautious. I can't rapid fire this one, sorry. Keep up with the explosions. I did all that for extra life. How petty do I look you? I am extremely petty, you jerks! Whee! This capsule contains an enhancement for your helmets. I was about to say harnets. Which will allow you to break some ceilings with a headbutt. He doesn't mean dashing into it, he just means jump and you'll break like it. <laughs> also in the future, you might question why um why the light left like nineteen castles everywhere. The question of that, uh he was too cautious, I guess. Oh god. I've been missing one billion health, huh? I don't know. I'll be able to get some back. <sighs> I died, jump. Apparently, I dashed. That was kind of embarrassing. Let's go get that life again. Uh, I can't believe I just walked off. Well, you die. You die too. You all die! It's an express death train to Deathville. I have problems. Also, subtext I did not explain that. Them, um. You collect energy when your energy, when your health is full, and we, and we'll. I'm just making stupid mistakes. Oh. What was I saying? You collect energy when those the um, energy is filled to fill up the sub tanks. That's what I was trying to say. Apparently I had a speech impediment, I couldn't even say the simplest things. Yeah, that's I what I just did was sorta of not hidden at all, but if you pay attention you can see it off to the side. It just had uh, some new fills there for you just in case. Oh. 
gotta be careful here. Because he can't that he can't hit you off to the side. By the way, he really doesn't damage you at all. If you die against him, you probably just fell off the stage, I know. Even his even the weapon you get from him doesn't damage you. Which is sad. I almost dashed into him. Where is it? I couldn't find him. Oh! Also, in this game, I uh, think only up to Nina X2, when you dash and just fire a single pellet, it has the power of fully charged bullets. Of a fully charged um, shot. Which is. Odd because that's not explained at all in this game. <laughs> okay, I'm going to call it an episode here. I will see you in the next part of Let's Play Put Ming Man um, X. Till then, take care, kitties. And as always, have a wonderful day.